All right, it's taken a while to get around to filming this. Um, I received this for Christmas. Uh, yes, this was a family present. My uh, daughter and her boyfriend thought uh, MSI guy would like one of these, <laughs> and he does. <laughs> yeah, it's a it's a handheld Tesla coil, official Tesla coil. There's a, a coil on the front here. And uh, it's actually marked. It's marked um, 800 turns. Uh, it's 800 turns of 0.12 millimeter wire. It's resonant at 1.2 to 1.4 megahertz. And uh, yeah, so Tesla coils are resonant. It has uh, big batteries in it. It's got two of those 16, what, 18 650s. Uh, and it's got uh, some adjustments in the back here. Uh, we can turn it on. It's got uh, the voltage of the battery and it says if it's zappy, the saps and then yeah, if you push the trigger. So it's got it's got a trigger button down here. It's got a ground strap. So it needs an, it needs some type of grounding to make it work as lightning. You know, you need to be anyway. Got to have some capacitance ground at least. You can have it do single strikes or automatic multiple strikes. Um, and uh, it is frightening. <laughs> it is absolutely frightening. And uh, I will not turn it on while it's on my bench because it's just way too dangerous. Um, if not for me to kill all my nice things, you know. I like my nice toys. Uh, it says handheld Tesla coil. I don't know how much these cost. That was a gift. This is the V3.0 Plus. Um, yeah, I'll show you some pictures here of the insides. Um, yeah, there's a circuit board with some big MOSFETs and uh, some coils and stuff. So it's kind of like a, a really big DC to DC converter and uh, resonant and yeah, all that stuff in it. So. Um, so the way that the um, the way that the transformer works, this hundred turn transformer, is you need primary windings, and you go, well, what, where are the primary windings? Well, primary windings are here on the circuit board. There's actually some traces, so there's four four turns. So it's a four turn primary right on this PC board, and then this is a six hundred turn secondary. And then uh, it's almost like having uh, a safety, you know, if you don't put the magazine in the gun, it probably won't fire. So, yeah, um, yeah, you put this on and now it's loaded. <laughs> now it's ready to do its thing. So when I store it, I always make sure I undo this thing because it's not going to hurt you touching here. Um, it's only after it goes through the transformer, the dust look well. So, yeah, it is pretty cool. Big heat sink on it. It's made really, really well. So, yeah, these are... These are super, super cool. All right, so uh, we sh should we uh, turn it on? What do you think? <laughs> should we turn it on? All right, so it wouldn't be the MSI guy channel if we didn't have some electronics in here. So uh, I'll turn the room lights off with this. A 555 timer uh, flashing an LED and it's battery powered from that thing over there. Um, so it's completely safe to zap. It's not going to kill all my expensive stuff in the garage, all right? So, uh, yeah, let's go zappy zappy. There we go. Sound Sounds good? All right, I'm going to turn the room lights off. There we go. Now, now we'll get some zappy zappies. Uh, let's, go over, let's go over here for a second, just for... Oh, yeah, look at that. All right, that looks good. Okay, back to the uh, back to the timer here. There we go. Okay, we're zappy zappy. We're gonna kill the five five five. Let's see how it does. All right, make sure I don't zap my microphone. Okay, what do you say? Let's zap the power supply first. Oh, there we go. I got some strikes on VCC. All right, it's still working. Uh, some ground strikes. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, we're getting some uh, extra flashes when I hit the uh, hit the ground. That's pretty cool. 
Okay, let's go in. Oh, oh yeah. Get on the other side of the camera here. Oh, I'm zapping, I'm zapping directly to the feedback resistor. And, wow, I haven't killed it yet. Okay, let's, let's turn up the juice here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow. Okay. How's that? You think your Arduino would, <laughs> would survive? The analog electronics is tough. Oh, come on. I got to kill this thing. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Nope. Okay, well, there you go. Kind of uneventful, but cool at the same time. All right, and you thought the 555 was uh, no longer needed for anything. Look at that. Completely uh, zappy compliant. All right. All right, there we go. Handheld Tesla coil. Loads of fun.